So how the heck do you ollie? That's, that's where you jump on the skateboard, right? But you gotta start somewhere, right? And I'm gonna teach you guys how to ollie. The first thing I wanna tell you before trying any skateboarding trick, including ollie, that it's 95% up to you whether you learn this trick or not, okay? The best thing you can do when you're trying any skateboard trick is watch a lot of skate videos and study the skateboarders and try and try and try and try, okay? Because I can tell you how to do it all day and it's not gonna matter unless you put some real time and effort into what you're doing. As most people know, the ollie is the basic maneuver in skateboarding. Whether you want to learn gaps, rails, basic flip tricks, or even airing over kids. You gotta learn how to ollie. Alright, you probably already know the basics of doing ollie, but you know, hey, I'm gonna freaking tell you it anyway, okay? So, you're gonna kick here with your back foot, of course. It's gonna kick the board up. At that moment, you're gonna slide your front foot up and jump all at the same time, okay? When you're first learning the trick, you're gonna be doing kind of weak, like, taps, where just, you just go like that, and you're not even gonna know how, if you got off the ground the first two times you actually do an ollie. So it's good to have a friend nearby telling you how you're doing. As far as foot placement goes, I would say the very back of the tail to get a nice solid pop, and I would say, you know, make sure it's the center of the tail too, okay? Because if you go inward a little bit, it'll give you a faster pop, but you're not gonna have as much stability, especially with learning. Uh, so I would say the very center so you have control. Your front foot, I would put the very middle of the board. Um, if you put it further back, it'll give you a higher ollie, but you know, as far as learning, you're gonna have more control if you put it a little higher up. So go with the center of the board and the back center of the table. And just to demonstrate, back foot about here, front foot about there. So if you're just learning how to skateboard, you're going to be practicing this trick a lot. And naturally, you're going to want to try to learn it standing still because that's easier for you. But you're going to have to force yourself to learn it moving because, you know, gaps, grinds, everything. It involves a moving ollie. Okay, so to wrap everything up, guys, there's the three magic steps in learning how to ollie. The pop, the slide, and the jump all at the same time, okay? If you walk away with anything from this video, remember, pop, slide, jump, okay? When you start doing it, it's gonna look a lot like, like that, or you're gonna be like, going like that, okay? That's normal, that's how everybody learns. So don't get discouraged, just keep on going. Try, try, and try, all right? One thing, when you get pretty consistent with getting in the air, you might wanna try kicking down on your tail harder, as hard as you can to get a really nice, solid snap, okay? That's gonna make your the, your board pop up in the air a little a little harder, and when you slide your foot up, it's gonna make your ollie a lot higher. So remember, once more, pop, slide, jump. Try, try, and try. Subscribe or die. I'm freaking out. That was a stupid kick. When you land one, the very first time you land one, girls come up and give you drinks for free. My point exactly. You didn't even know I was going to use you that way, did you? <laughs> this is not sweet tea. You might get better at it, but eventually you're going to have to step it up and practicing it while moving. 